People says, oh, that man of God, I honor him. He's, he's dead. I honor him so much. He was a great man of God. But when that man of God was close to you, you never honored him. You never honored him financially, verbally. You never respected him. Never. So it's like a book. You can read a book at this distance, but it's so close. You cannot give value. You cannot uh, read. You cannot understand the greatness of that book. It's the same with the man of God. The veil of religion. It requires more maturity to honor people of God, men and women of God that are around us in the present day, that men of God that have already deceased or that they are far away from us. It takes more maturity. Can you understand this? May God open your eyes. May God open, I said, may God open your eyes. If you can see me, when I am departed, this mantle will be given to you, Elijah and Elisha. If you can see me, no, if you can see my mantle, if you can see me as a man and still honor me, the lowest level of honoring is to honor men's mantle. Is to honor the mantle of a man of God. But the highest level of honoring is to honor the men of the mantle. Some of you guys are so spiritual that you always said, I must honor that mantle. And that's right and biblical. But when you honor the men men who make mistakes but carries a mantle but not only his ministry but he as a man of God as your brother in Christ wow. that's the highest level these Pharisees and scribes used to honor people of God who were already dead all oh, these amazing prophets of many many centuries before they were great women and men of God oh hallelujah praise be to God or people that are far away from us all those people but the living son of God the greatest prophets of all prophets Jesus himself was among them and they couldn't honor him hallelujah because that's the spirit of religion I pray today for you to repent of dishonor of disrespect to men and women of God even in in their mistakes God is speaking to you not to your neighbor no to you He's speaking right now you must begin to honor women and men of God you must start to respect more, honor more verbally, financially.